Thank you. The mother of the little girl who died at a Speedway daycare is talking exclusively tonight with Eyewitness News. I just ask for strength every day to be able to keep moving. Her daughter, 10-month-old Talia Brigham, died on Thursday. A daycare employee found the infant unconscious in her car seat. The coroner is still trying to figure out how she died. Our Scott Swan tells us how Talia's mother is coping and what she says she wants now. These are the images that bring a grieving mother joy. Her smile and her hair, oh my gosh. She so much hair, hair from day one. Talia Brigham was everything to her family. But I'm telling you a lot, the minute she was here, it, it changes your life. Then, in an instant, their lives changed. The 10-month-old found unconscious at the Miracles and Blessings daycare. Her mother will never forget that day. It was a call from the daycare. I was at work. Um, she was just frantically saying she wasn't breathing. Her little girl would not survive. I don't know what happened. Um, I want to know what happened. But I just don't want it to happen again. For now, these are the images the family wants you to see. Their beautiful little girl who had such an impact on those around her. She was just a light of joy. I mean, it changed our house the minute she was here. Now, this Carmel family is leaning on their faith in the midst of unspeakable grief. In the beginning, I wanted to be angry and shut God out, but I had one of my neighbors. She looked at me and said that I, I can't, I can't do that. I have to let him in to help get through this, and I did. Sunday, the family will bury the baby that they called Tally, celebrating her bubbly, spunky personality. <coughs> the girl with the infectious laugh who leaves a legacy in her brief 10-month life. In Carmel, Scott Swan, Channel 13 Eyewitness News. Services for Talia take place tomorrow at the Lighthouse Tabernacle in Speedway. Visitation is from 3 until 6. A private funeral service is then at 6 o'clock.